Margins of intimacy is a shift towards interiors in my practice and circles kind of ideas of the intimacy of, of the home. Coming up with the, the title of the show, it's a bit like the way I make paintings in that I'm super interested in the poetics. It comes down to the way the words sound when they're put together. And when I think of the word margins, I think of boundaries or edges, compositionally framing through doors or looking out of windows or thinking about the kind of threshold between interior and exterior. They're predominantly actual spaces where I've made drawings and it's always spaces that I've spent time in. So whether it be like my own space or friends' homes or travels, time lapses between when I make the drawing and make the painting. And I purposely don't come back to any photographs. So I'm interested in that space between making the drawing and making the work and memory and invention that comes into that space. And so they become this kind of hybrid of a memory and my emotional realm <laughs> as I make them. Whether I'm painting interiors or landscapes, what I'm actually interested in as a painter is internal spaces. There's definitely a sense of coziness and comfort and warmth and they're all quite personal interiors and there's a lot of kind of me in those spaces and my experience of those spaces in the in the paintings and working from largely memory and feeling to create them is I think what imbues them with that sense of coziness. I'm also kind of interested in subtly undermining that through perspective and scale and things like um, bottles and books are slightly tilted or landscapes kind of pressing forward into the interior spaces. People have described the paintings as cinematic, which sits sort of beautifully with me. Compositionally, I really enjoy using the device of a doorway or a door to frame the painting, but also set the viewer up to be peering in on a scene that is not theirs. But I also think kind of alluding to moments just passed through books open or cups of tea sitting Taking the interior genre to a large scale has been really exciting for me. And exploring the kind of intimacy of the domestic space, that's been super exciting. 